TV Channel Ukraine presents The Best Husband, Episode 5 You bastard. I knew it. Drive around. Pull over. Mila. Are you crazy? Are you following me? Did you buy a bracelet for her? Get out, bitch. Get out. Calm down. I'll tear her hair out. She's my bookkeeper. Your bookkeeper. Should I believe it? I don't give a damn. Go home mad. And you? I'm going to a bank. Bastard. Go home. Stupid. Well, Ilya Sarjevich, thank you for walking me home. And special thanks for your idea with your friends. It was beautiful. Goodbye. Irina Ivanovna. I noticed you have a stall in the kitchen wobbling and the tap is leaking. Really? I'll call a master tomorrow. If you trust me, I can try to do it myself. Well, no harm in trying. Let's go. But it doesn't mean anything. Of course. Yes. What is it? Elsa place. Elsa. She wants to walk. It's 2 a.m. It happens, Gleb. Okay, Elsa, we'll go now. That's all we need, sleep. I'll walk her myself. Nina? Nina? Gleb, let's sleep. Nina, this isn't good. Sorry, we have a baby. And there's Elsa's fault, drooling, dirt everywhere. Gleb, I've known Elsa for seven years. I took her as a little puppy. I love her, she's my family, how can I live without her? Not our family. Sorry, I work hard at work, you work hard at home with a baby. And that dog. What do you suggest? I don't know. Think. Mom, hi. Hi. Can Elsa stay with you for a while? What do you mean for a while? Until Ilyusha grows up? Mom, please. No, no and no. I explained everything to you last time. 
Mom, please, me and Gleb started fighting. If you're already fighting over a dog, what happens next, honey? Okay, I got it, sorry. Please, wait, no offense. How are you doing anyway? It's okay, bye. I must be too strict with my daughter. I think you all... That's mine. Thank you. Yes, Nina. Hello, Ilya Sarjevich, are you busy? Well, a little. Can you babysit Ilyasha? I have to go away on business. Sure, of course. I'll be there. Thank you. I have to help your daughter. Mm -hmm. no. Yes, because I'm very bad and you're very good. Don't talk bad about you. I don't understand how it could happen between us. I don't know what got into me. Not into you. But into us. Feelings have no logical basis. I didn't think I could get carried away. But it's all your fault. You're an incredible woman. See you tonight. What do you mean? I haven't fixed your stool yet. Elsa. Elsa, honey, I'm so sorry. I love you so much, I will definitely come back for you. It's not for long. I love you. Did you buy the whole store? Is there anything left on the card? Or your bookkeeper will scold you. Where do they do such bookkeepers? Aren't you tired? I am. Maybe I should be a bookkeeper too. Wow. What? Where does this come from? Right. Your bookkeeper must have forgotten it. Come on in. Come on, come on. As you see, living conditions are good. There are no neighbors yet. Two meals a day, walk. If she needs a veterinarian, we will provide him. How long are you going to keep your dog here? How long is it possible? It depends on your financial capabilities. Here is the full price list. Elsa is a family dog. I've never left her anywhere. Don't worry, it's gonna be all right. All right, it's not all right. Bastard. 
What are you looking there for? She's your lover. Stop lying me. What do you want? I want truth. The truth is I am a normal man and I want to relax sometimes. I have the right to it, yes. I like beautiful women. So she isn't the only one. How many? I didn't count. My math is so bad. You sleep with prostitutes and then you make up with me? What makes you better? A stamp in the passport? Grisha, we already talked about it. You promised that everything would be as it used to be. You don't like something? Get out out. Grisha. Hi, Glev. Remember when you asked me to go kayaking and show me that beautiful waterfall? Glev, I feel terrible. Irina Ivanovna. Irina Ivanovna, open the door. Irina Ivanovna, I know. I know you're home. Open the door. Elia Sarshevich, go away. Have I offended you? No, but don't come anymore. What happened is a mistake. Don't say so. I am not incredible at all. I am the most ordinary not young woman. I know better. I reopen, please. And we'll talk as adults. Exactly, as adults. Let's be honest, none of this will work out. Please don't come here or to the library again. Let's pretend nothing happened. We'll be just parents of our children. That's it. I need nobody. Why aren't you sleeping? Aren't you tired? I can't sleep.
Nina. Let's hire a babysitter. I will be easier for you. You can go to work again. Gleb, I told you no babysitter. Ilya is still small. I can't trust him to another woman. Well, I offered. Thank you. You know, Vadik asked me to go fishing Saturday. Will you let me go? Sure, go. Nina, I understand you're not sleeping because of Elsa. Do you think I'm wrong? Yes, I do. What do we do? I don't know, Gleb. Yes, I'm going down, Vodik. He's here. I have to go. Okay. Thank you. Call me. The connection will be there. See you. Hi. Hi. Make yourself comfortable. You can even sleep. We'll buy worms and go because I forgot about them. Are you okay? Vodik, pull over. Where are you going? I guess the fishing is cancelled. I have to go somewhere else. Go alone. That's all the fishing. Are you cold, honey? It's okay, we're going home. We'll eat and go to sleep. Yes, honey, yes. Elsa? Elsa? Darling, good girl. Come here, I missed you. Yes, Elsa. Gleb? Elsa? You know, I thought if she was part of our family, she should live with us. Thank you. Gleb, you'll love her. You'll love her for sure. Elsa, I'm so glad. My good girl, Elsa. Hi. Hi. Let's play. If you're not in a hurry. With pleasure. Black again. I don't care. And where's everybody? Why aren't they here? Are they ill? In your library. And why not go? It's warm there. Fresh newspapers are free. They give tea there. Here. Sorry. Yes, son. Dad. Are you busy tonight? No, I'm not. Can you babysit Alicia? With pleasure. Till the morning. I want to surprise Nina. How? Dad. Can't your father ask? 
Okay, surprise is surprise. I'll be right there. Thank you, Dad. Sorry, Mikhailovich, extra duties. I know, job. Ilya Sarjevich, I'll go, you know where the mixture is, the diapers are there. What if he wakes up at night? We'll be back by then. Gleb said that it was an all-night surprise. What do you mean? I blurted it out, but don't tell him about it, okay? Okay, I wonder what he is up to. If he wakes up, you can give him some water, but usually he sleeps well till the morning. Nina, I'm definitely an experienced granddad, but all night. No, I understand. I'll tell Gleb that and we'll come back earlier. No, that's not the thing. Maybe you could call your mom and she'll come here. It will be safer together. Yes. Sure, I'll call her. I'm sorry to pry. But is there a second grandfather? My father? I guess he is somewhere. I don't remember him well. I was small when they divorced. But why? Irina is a beautiful woman. She is. You should have seen her when she was young. Everyone turned around as she walked. But she didn't pay attention to anyone. She loved dad. It was hard time. They needed to earn money. Dad went to work and never came back. How so? Mom found out that he found another family there and had a baby. He didn't help us with money. So my mom had to do everything herself. She was studying at the time. Okay, sorry. I have to go. I'll call mom. Don't worry. It's gonna be okay. All right. Goodbye. So, mom, do you agree? Yes. But you know it will be hard for him to take care of the baby all night. He's very shy. He'll never call you and ask for help. And I think he's a little bit afraid of you, so don't hurt him. All right, great. Mom, thank you. I love you. Bye, all right. Ilyusha's in good hands. Double protection. Where are we going? This is the end of the city. Have patience. You'll see soon. Now close your eyes and don't peek. Can you give me a hint? Never. Try to guess. Okay. I closed them. Open your eyes. Where are we? What is it? Whose house is this? Do you like it? I do. It's beautiful here. Welcome. Gleb, I'm surprised. Wow. This is so beautiful. A living room. A fireplace. Great. I bought this house for you, me and my son. And Elsa, of course. You bought it? 
A friend was going abroad and selling it urgently. I've already given him part of the sum. Then we'll have to sell the apartment. And for the rest, I will take a loan. Glab, it's very expensive. Don't worry, we'll pay it off. The company is doing very well. Let's go. I'll show you around. Wow, what a view. I've dreamt of it my whole life. I knew it. Because I work as a part-time psychic. Thank you. And the furniture stays here. You can change everything. No, no. I like everything. It's so cozy here, really. Thank you. Let me show you the second floor. Let's go. Here you are. He's sleeping. And you were afraid. Though you were a real colonel. Lieutenant Colonel. And I wasn't afraid. Oh, yeah. Then who asked Nina to make me calm? Not me. I'll call her and figure it out. Stand down. Why should we bother our children? That's right. We won't bother them. But you can go. I can't. I promised my son. I can't go too. I promised Nina to stay here too. Well... Then if we both can't... Let's have a rest. Where? Here, together. Yes. No, I'd rather sit on the couch all night. Okay, all right. The bed is yours. To us. You are the best husband. Don't praise me too much. Irina Ivanovna, why do you think I can hurt you? Elias Sarshevich, no one can hurt me anymore. My life hardened me. Why can't you accept the idea that you can love at all age? Love? Do you hear yourself? We used to have our children near us, so we lived for them. But they have their own family now and they are happy. And we have time to live for ourselves. For each other. I think we have already discussed this question. Sure, I remember our conversation about washing socks. Not just about that. 
also about the stool that I successfully fixed myself, and all the rest. And you're a tough woman. Are you happy? Very. I feel the same. Is it possible? I guess it is. Look who it is. Wow, my beloved husband. And you're still blooming. You could have called me and asked how I had been doing. Hello, how are you? Terrible. Grisha, you didn't even leave money for the housekeeper, let alone me. I have no money for gas. You're going to earn it now. Get ready. Again? And what is it this time? Your job is to come, give and go. Do it. I don't get it. I don't get it. What part of come, give and go didn't you understand? Just go. Come on. Fuck. Grisha. Are you waiting for me? Hello? Grisha, there's a homeless guy outside my car. What should I do? Grisha, I'm scared. Come on, start. It hurts. It hurts. Milaka, take the bill for the apartment. They've just brought it. Are you crying? Why are you crying? Vera, go out. Asshole bastard. You sit here and drink. Where did you send me? So I can get fucking killed? 
Calm down, who needs you? Calm down, I was so scared. So drink. I won't drink. I said, I said drink. Baby, you did it. Why are you so worried? It's okay. Nothing happened. Here's your compensation for the stress. Fuck your compensation. I won't deliver anything again. Mila. Come here, darling. I love you so much. Grisha. I'm serious. I can deliver money, but not drugs. Shut up. Who asked you to look into the package? Listen. I don't want to go to jail like you. And don't get me involved in your criminal business. So this is it, right? Teach your girlfriends, and I'm leaving. Leaving? Grisha. I'll show you now. Don't touch me, don't touch me, I hate you. Vera, call the police. Are you threatening me? With the police? Don't do it. Get out of here. Hello? Yes. Yes, I'll be there. But in a while, okay. All right. Got it. If you open your mouth, you die. That goes for you too. Milak up. My poor baby. I did everything for him. I gave up my job, endured his mistresses, gave the baby away. What did you think was the reason? That was not Grisha's baby, Vera. You shouldn't have given the baby away. Bring me my phone. I'm in the emergency room, Mila is getting stitches. That's how it is. You should have seen her face, it's just a bloody mess. Why are you silent? I couldn't leave a beaten woman alone. I hope soon. Okay, bye. How are you? Better? It hurts. My whole body hurts. Look what that bastard did. Why did he beat you up? It doesn't matter, Glav. This is sick. He was different before the prison. Prison? I got it. Great. Why are you looking at me like this? You think for whom I traded you? That's not what I'm thinking. Whether he's your husband or not, you should report him to the police. This cannot continue. I don't know, Glav. You don't know? Are you kidding? Go get the certificate of the beating. They wrote something here. I don't know. I think that's what we need. Let's go to the police. You'll file a report. I'll file it. And what's next? Should I go back to him? Well... Do you have someone to go to? No. Okay, we'll figure it out. Their working day must be ended. There's no one here. What do you mean? The police are open around the clock. Are you afraid? I... I can go with you. No, I'll do it.
Yeah. Nina, I really don't know what to tell you. I have to bring Miller to our house. What do you mean? I know you don't like it as well as I do. But Miller's state is terrible. It's a pity to look at her. She has nowhere to go. Her husband, bastard, almost crippled her. Don't be jealous, Nina. I told you. She doesn't mean anything to me. Glab, do what you want. So, did you find a bathroom? I did. Can I ask you for some water? You sure you don't need help? Thank you. What did the police say? Do you think anyone's gonna want to figure it out? There are a lot of battered wives no one wants. You have to leave him. I know, where to, he'll find me anywhere. Then you have to leave the city. I'm thinking about it. I see you have another car. I used one again. Don't you have money? I really don't have money. This is my father's car. I scratched mine. What happened? I was in a car accident after one conversation on the roof. I'm sorry. This is our house. We live here now. Wow, cool. We just moved here. And you said you had no money. It's true. It's all in the circulation. I had to take a loan. I helped to pay it off quickly. So your company is doing well. I'm not complaining. Gleb, I am sorry. But Mila cannot stay in our house. I don't want. I just can't stand her here. Pardon the intrusion. 